Good morning everybody and welcome to Visit Fout Coast. It's May Day Monday and I think that's the 3rd of May, isn't it? It's day 8 of the Star Wars filming in Cleveland. And I know I said I wasn't coming out to do an update today but frankly my curiosity was killing me so I knew yours would be too. So I thought this morning we would have a little bit of a change of venue and we've come to the back of Jubilee Gardens car park so we're going to walk up to the front because I can see a crane. But before we get to that point, don't forget, make sure that you've subscribed to the Visit Felt Coast YouTube channel and you've hit that little bell for notifications. Because if you've been watching these updates, you'll know that we get some astonishing weather in Cleveland and it is in fact a beautiful place. So Star Wars might have brought you here, but when all this is over and done with, I bet you're going to come back, aren't you? You're going to come back and explore. So this is the little works area where they've got all the kit and the gear and everything. And I've had a tip off this morning that some um, equipment was being put into place and a crane was being installed at Jubilee Gardens. So we're going to go and have a look and we're going to go and see we're going to go and see what's to do and I'm just looking at this fencing here oh that's a big one I think we need to I, do you know that were a really good punt that weren't it because I didn't deliberately come this way for any other reason than to just make it look a bit different because I'm conscious that we're kind of looking at the same thing each day and any of our regular viewers are probably not really bothered about Star Wars but for once, I managed to get to the right side of the barriers. Oh, big crane. That's a very big crane. So I wonder what they're doing. Apparently they're setting up for a stunt. I'm still worrying about them trees. I'm still worrying about what state they're going to be in. Hopefully they'll leave them flat on the floor like that. Because the weather's going to be appalling this afternoon. Two o'clock, there's a um, weather warning for 46, 50 mile an hour winds. So that's not going to be amusing when they're trying to work in that. If you're familiar with this area, you'll know what a 50 mile an hour wind feels like when it's blowing straight off the Irish Sea. And there's absolutely nothing to stop it. I've just noticed them actually as I'm as I'm talking to you, at the back of the security guy, on the lamp posts, they fastened, they fastened the trunks of trees to match, to match that tree. Morning. Morning. Not quite the same weather today. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of the Star Trek fans I was talking to on. Uh, Saturday? I think it was Saturday. I'm losing track of days completely. This is all blending into one for me. So these railings are new as well on this side of um, on this side of the road. And I'm just I just paused then because the green screens flopped. Oh dear. I think we're gonna fall victim to the to the great seaside weather. It's just a nightmare this weather. So obviously, somebody's going to do something that needs a crane. Pass. Could be anything. Very interesting. I'm not going to hang about this morning. This is just going to be a quick one because, number one, it's Bank Holiday Monday and even I deserve some time off. I've been working this morning. I've already done about five hours before everybody else woke up. <clears throat> and it's raining. And much as I'm dedicated to the cause... There's a, there's a limit to how wet I'm prepared to get in the line of duty. So here we are on a very wet, very cold seafront. Actually, it's not that cold. It is cold, but I've known it a lot worse. So don't forget, make sure that you've subscribed to the Visit Fowl Coast YouTube channel. Make sure that you've signed up for notifications. And we will be back with you tomorrow hopefully because the the bad weather is forecast to make a reappearance tomorrow as well 
so we'll see you soon give this a like if you've enjoyed it bye for now